Welcome in everyone and welkom back to the channel. I'm AC Kingpin 27 with you today in MLB The Show 22 to continue our Legends roster gameplay series this season. And today we're going to be taking a look at the Colorado Rockies and the Legends that are here in game for this squad. You see here, we're going to be taking on the Texas Rangers. Now the Rockies lineup has a ton of hitters added to this, this team, but not any pitchers. There's no Mike Hampton this year. Um, so these Rockies starting rotation and pitching staff is going to be current Rockies players, but the lineup is flooded with legends and past uh, Rocky players. So we'll be able to take a look at those guys when we jump in here to the lineups. As always, guys, drop a like on the video and I will continue this Legends gameplay series and I'll continue showcasing all of the Legends that are here in game for you to use and for you to take a look at in this series. I hope you guys are enjoying taking a look at all the players, the pitching staffs and the hitters alike as they get a chance to showcase for you guys out on the diamond here. We're going to be rocking some old school 97 Rockies uniforms. The Rangers are also rocking mid-90s home uniforms today. Now, this is a Rockies gameplay, so we're going to be playing here in Colorado. We'll make sure we play in Colorado today, even though the Rangers are the home team. We'll get up and get set here for you. And then, like I said, no Rocky pitchers. So this lineup is going to be the pitching staff going to have to fight. So Chad Cool is going to get the start today. Not a great record. It looks like he's going to be facing off against Martin Perez. But this lineup, this lineup brings back Trevor Story to play second base. Vinny Castillo going to be here at shortstop today. Larry Walker going to be manning right field. Looks like Todd Helton will be the man at first base. Dante Bichette going to DH for this squad because Nolan Arenado is back and playing third base. CJ Crone moves from the first base out to left field today. Charlie Blackman mans uh, the center field. And Elias Diaz is your starting catcher today, uh, rounding it out for this squad. You see the guys on the bench, Brendan Rodgers, Jose Iglesias, Connor Joe, all take a back seat with these legends guys in the lineup. Let's jump right in and let's play some baseball as the Rockies take on the Rangers here in today's game. You see it, like I said, Chad Cool taking on Martin Perez. Enjoy the gameplay, guys. Here we go. Live from beautiful Coors Field here in Denver, Colorado. MLB The Show has interleague action for you this afternoon. It's the Colorado Very excited to get more Rockies Legends gameplay up for y'all, too. Rangers. First pitch coming your I've been looking next. forward to this, now, this Rangers team. The only guy we're missing, I think, is like Andre Salaraga. Uh, we're missing some uh, some pitchers. I would have loved to see Mike Hampton get a look here with the Rockies this year. Just Martin Perez is going to pitch for Texas as the Rocky the hill, players come up. You see Trevor Story leading it off here as the Colorado team. Here we go. Speed differential between the fastball and the changeup is huge. Hitters, they have a hard time staying back. Trevor Story takes a strike as he leads things off. Now, I grew up in Northeast Ohio, and around Halloween... Uh, we had like scare houses all built up, like places do all over the country. Um, and I remember doing the pitching game where you had to like guess your speed on the third pitch. And, the pitch. and I won myself a Colorado Rockies hat as a kid, as like an eight, nine, ten year old kid. And that was probably one of the hats I wore the crap out of with that CR logo uh, on the hat. I loved that Foul logo. Uh, and follow this team. I enjoyed watching the Rockies gameplay here. Uh, once they join Major League Baseball. It's fun, fun time and some fun stadium and fun crowds to really enjoy. The lineup was potent with Walker, Bichette, Castilla, and like I said, Galarraga in there too. And Helton. Can't forget Todd Helton. Trevor Story battling here. Eight pitches, eighth pitch of the at-bat to start the game. To third. Takes it right to the third base. And that'll be the first out of the game here. Story is out. Still, made Perez throw a lot of pitches to start it. Here's our first defender. legend today, Vinny Castilla at the plate. That one That's down, down the line. Fair ball. Castilla's going to try for two here. It out of the corner, oh, he's got an easy stand-up like double. There we go. And he starts his so first hit of the game in Colorado is a double for Vinny Castilla. Let's go. That brings up... Larry. The right Larry fielder Larry Walker, Walker here. In for the Rockies. To the right That's going to advance the runner, but be the second out of the game. Of time to first, 
He's out. I should bring up the next lefty. First baseman, Todd Helton, going to get a look here. Todd Helton digging in for the Rockies. The baseman, this guy seven. has turned Todd. into Todd. a beast. Helton. Get First either. pitch doesn't find the zone. Rudder at third, two away. Center field. Oh, a lot of ball Tamaris. center field from the under it. Puts the All right. On that one. So we've seen a couple legends so far. Rocky's not first. scoring a run. Chad Cool is going to start it for him. Here we go. Like I said, we got to be very, very careful what we throw. We don't want to put this team behind because the pitching is just that terrible. It's like we're going to give up a triple on the first play of the game. The relay. Wow. This could be a long day for the Rockies pitching staff. Hammered that baseball very loud coming off the bat. 107 was the exit velocity. All right, Chad Cool is coming out. You can do this thing without giving up a run. You can do it here. Hard hit left side. Throwing home. Getting the runner at home. home All right. So we sacrificed the runner at first to get the guy at home. It's still a 0 0 ball game. What a play by Nolan Arenado at third base. Way to get the first out. Keep the man from scoring. Right into the play. That misses the zone. One and one. Seeger over at first with one away. Next you guys are new to the series. Nine times out of ten, I do like to let the catcher. Uh, call the pitch, call the game. Swing I will, you know, shake them off and call my own stuff from time to time. For the most part, I let this battery kind of play their own Shots game here. So. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Three and two now. On the ground, two and we get the double play. Got it, but win the inning. We gave up the, the triple, but no runs scored. All set for the start that of brings the up Dante so Bichette to start off the, the second. Back to work. Okay. Nice pitch. Right. Nice pitch. The key to his success is getting ahead early in the count. He cannot afford to go deep in the counts. Doesn't have a ton of. Oh, the shit unloads the ball to left field. Center. There we go. There. On its way. First one of the ball games. A solo home run for Dante the shit. Let's go, baby. 421 feet out it's to left field. Let's get another look well, at that one. Put a really nice swing on that one. Grab that one out of the off his time. knees there to take Rip that one out. Dug that one out of the dirt, so to speak. What a shot the there. Bat like that. There we go. No one there not are going to get his chance to really beats up on right handed pitching. The lefties, however, give him a little bit more trouble. Let's see if these guys can go back to back. Next offering is a nice pitch. For a strike. Patrick Johnson behind the plate. Patty Johnson the some boot, but I'd ask permission first before I called him that. Does a pretty good job back okay. there. Occasionally we'll see a couple of sideways looks from players, but that kind of comes with the territory, right? Next All right. pitch. Two and two. We're gonna count back in our favor. Stays the line. Way to fight, way to fight. We're battling. The wind of the pitch. This oh, one that's in the air out center, center field. field. Okay. That's the first out of the inning. Tavares makes the play, and there's one down. And here is C.J. Crone. C.J. Crone. Now, we moved Crone from first base out to the outfield to make way for Helton in this game. First offering, and it just misses. His bat stays in the lineup for Colorado. I didn't want to see him on the bench as like an 88 plus overall. Little chopper rolls foul. Yeah, two and one now. Come on. Two and one. Gotta throw your strike here. No, oh, we're swinging a bad pitch. First strike two. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's oh, CJ Crown oh, no, unloaded on a hanging changeup. Second solo home run of the inning. Second home run of the game. CJ Crone puts another run on the board here. 437 feet out to the outfield. 
knew what pitch he wanted to hit, spit on a some hanging changeup. Very deep to the bleachers. Paid off. So one out, nobody on. Charlie Blackman's gonna get a look here. Batting eight, the center fielder, Charlie Blackman. That's a slap base hit to left. Okay. That's going to bring up the number nine hitter here, the catcher for the Rockies. And now it's Elias Diaz. The catcher, number 35, Elias Diaz. He swings and hits a fly ball, center field. That's out number two. But the top of the order comes back to bat. There's two down. So the batting order turns over. Here's Trevor Story now. Come on, Story. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Good eye, it's two one is off the play. Two balls, no strikes to count. Blackman off of first with two away. Oh, we swung in a bad pitch. Two and one, though. Two and one's count. pitch and a foul ball. Ooh, just missed the change up there and a pitch foul okay, back okay. Right. he's, he's challenging us now we got Perez throwing pitches he's up over 30 pitches so far it's only the second inning two outs Swung on, popped so he's going to pop it up. That's going to end the inning for Colorado. In we head to the bottom of the second. Let's see if Poole can get a one two three in here. Keep the Rangers off the board. Back here in Denver. Now it's the DH. Adolis Garcia. For the Rangers. The and there's the hitter. strike. Looks like he's just sizing him up there. Really good Garcia. pitch to hit, but he took it all the way. Sometimes guys just want to set their timing. Uh-oh. Back-to-back one sliders. On that well. one's going to go. Who gives there. up a solo shot to Douglas Garcia? Unfortunate. Unfortunate. All right, let's pick it back up here. Come on. It's 2-1. Come on, Kool. This one. could be a... Uh, a slugfest with the way the Rockies pitching staff is built for this game. And there's a foul ball. We might be giving up runs to Texas. And we might be trying to slug away with these legend Rockies players. Oh, and two now. And a foul ball. He stays alive. The pitch. Calling for multiple sinkers in a row Bounce here. to the right side. Fires over to first. All right, we're okay here. And that's the first out. Nice recovery after giving up the homer. That Here's Leody Tavares. The center fielder. Leody. Come on. Tavares. Ooh. And first offering is fouled off. Catcher likes to call that sinker. He swings and fouls. Let's keep one the ball off. low in the zone. Left hand batter waits. Blackman can make that center. play. Blackman racing over to make the catch. That's two outs in the inning now. Come on. Seven. The right field. Here's Cole Calhoun. Oh. Let's get Calhoun. Let's sit him down here. Come on. Swings through that one. Nice pitch. On the ground, right side. This looks like extra base. That might be a double or better for First these guys here. And we're going to hold them in second. And the double puts the tying run in right. scoring position. These guys are rocking. Away. Anything that's not that Take sinker so far. Ezekiel Duran. And that one fouled off. Settle down, cool. Keep that run off the board. Keep the Rockies with the lead. And now the one. This one chopped on the ground. But All right, foul. we're good here. Let's see if we can get him with a slider. Get some confidence back in this pitch. There it is. All right. He gave up the solo shot, but the Rock still beat the game 2-1. On That's okay. There we go. Castillo coming up. Ooh, nice cutter. A lot of movement on that pitch. Last inning. 
Threw a lot of pitches. Lifted in the air, right center. Got a field. chance to hit the gap. Right field is going to make the Calhoun play. Brings it in. One up right. down. Larry that brings up Larry Walker. Walker. Come on, Walker. The Rockies. Larry Walker. First offering misses the mark. The wind of the pitch. Swing That's a drive. Smashed on a line. Center field is going to make the play, though. They're playing him deep here. They're playing him deep in the outfield. Next for Colorado. Tom Helton gets his Tom second Helton. look of the game. Hit it well, but flied out to the Todd. deepest part of the outfield his first time. Next offering is down First low. Pitches the ball. Let's ball go. One. That's a base hit. Line drive, base hit, right center field. Right, Helton gets on the board with a hit today. Keeps seeming alive. Nice line Don drive. Don Tabuchek gets his second at bat. Here front, we go. But just stayed Don't through play. it nice enough and yeah. ripped it into the outfield. Now at the plate, Don Good Don eye, Tabuchek. good eye. Next pitch downstairs. Ball one. Wind blowing in eight mile an hour from left Next field. So is foul back. The fact that these guys have hit Help. two bombs at left field is two amazing. Away. The wind is blowing in. The next off misses. And, one. and it's two and one. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Two and one now. Rolled oh, softly. Okay, nice but cutter there. Foul. Two and two, two outs. Helton over there on first base. The pitch. On the ground, out to short. That's going to be the third out of the inning. Okay. We head to the bottom of the third. Rocky's still up two to one here. Set for the bottom of the third. And stepping in, the rookie left fielder, Josh Smith. The Rangers. On the ground. Got him to chase after one there. Whips it across. One pitch, one out here in the third. Marcus Simeon, he tripled the lead off the bottom of the first, but they weren't yes, able to did. get him home. He did triple it. That's in there for strike one. The 0-1. One. One All right, we got him looking inside on that sinker. What are we going to throw that slider? Let's see if we have some confidence in this pitch. That's a pop-up. Two up, two down. All right, two outs in the end now. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. Two outs, Not base is empty. Seager stands in now. Seager. Ooh, Ooh, that ball one. he could have taken deep. That's a bad placement with that serve. Yeah, the right hander deals. Swing and a ground that ball. Should out be to the short. third out of the inning, though. Okay, so three three. Rockies still have that one run one, two, lead. Three. Back here at Coors Field. Nolan and Arenado getting a look Nolan here. And, and here he comes. Nolan. And the pitch is outside. Oh, that's a nice ball pitch. One. Painting the black on the outside corner, but it's called a ball. The lefty, the 1-0. Yeah, there's the strike. Right, we'll take that one. 1-1 one one now. Come on. So, a foul ball makes it a little bit early. Two. A little bit early, but great distance there. Come on, straighten that one out. And now the lefty stays High alive. fastball. I just can't say no to that pitch. There you go. Two and two misses. now. Two and two. Oh, well, this is a guy that can be frustrating for pitchers because he fouls off so many pitches and grinds out the at-bat. I'm there you sure go. there's sometimes now where we're pitchers rather just give up a first-pitch single 50 than have to waste six or seven pitches the fourth. on one hitter. Smash to the left side. That's going to be the first out. Tosses across okay. the first. Lead off hitter right. retired in the fourth. Next to hit for the C.J. Crone after that massive Crone. shot he had early. He's already homered here in this one. Second at-bat of the game. And he swings swinging and for the fences on that one. Tried to sneak one down the right and side with the shift. So they got the shift playing to the left. He tried to sneak that one right down the right field line. In the air, left field, Popped up a cutter. Smith should have this one. That's out number two. Squeezes it. Two away. 
Here's now Charlie Bennett. Blackman. All right, Blackman. Here you go, boss. Two outs here. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul. I like his little short, compact swing. Kicks and deals. Nice pitch. Nice cutter. 0-2 oh, now. Not a battle to stay in this at bat. And a foul there ball, he stays alive. Make this pitcher work. Got him <laughs> he watched the cutter go right by it. No. Welcome back, John right, here we go. We're back. Singleton with you. And leading On the mound, still with Chad Cole here in the fourth. That's in for a strike. Good. Over 80% of his first pitches are strikes. Oh. You're doing that. Could have a really good day out there. Anyway. Nice call. Next offering is that was a beautiful a pitch Holy. there. The 0 2. Stays Slider's on. starting to get some confidence back, so too. He's starting to control where that needs to be. Right now. He's got to go through the heart of this lineup. Slap the other way. Foul. Can't get it by him here. Another inside slayer here. All right, that gets the round ball side. for the first out of the inning. sends it over to first. One out in the bottom of the fourth. Next is now the designated the hitter, designated Adolis hitter. Garcia. Adolis. Swing and okay, inside and low sinker, starting to get some action. Starting to get some foul offs and some swings and misses so far. I keep putting that sinker in that same spot. And it's fouled away. All right. On to the third time, a little bit lower and more in the middle of the plate. And a foul Ooh, ball. He Garcia stays alive. trying to rocket that ball. The pitch. And there we go. There's the strikes. punch out for Cool. And two down. Really love the pitch sequence. First right strikeout of the game. On the, same page the, right now. the first baseman. Low. Stands in now and watches great strike pitch, one. Great pitch. He didn't swing at it. I don't love the location, right but we'll take it there. Deals. Swing and a miss. Coming and back strong. Righty delivers. This to third. Good foul, baby. Ooh, baby. Foul. And a pitch. Ripped on a line to center. Blackman should have Blackman. that one. No problem Makes to end the fourth. Two to one, Colorado Major. up here through four Back innings. Here at the ballpark, ready now for the fifth catcher inning. batting number and nine coming to the plate here. To Elias the Diaz. Out to center. He puts a jolt to into that ball. That's going to be deep center field and the first and out of down. the fifth inning. Well, on the mound, that brings up the top of the order now for their third at bat like of the game. Trevor Story is going to take it here. Here's Trevor Story. And first offering is fouled off. The pitch. And Up over one. 60 pitchers for the pitches for the Rangers starter here today. Good work we've done uh, having pitch. Perez throw pitches here. And downstairs. And the pitch. That one. Story Cameron rockets Center that baseball. Field. We're running. We're running for two here. We're going to try to go three. Trevor Story going to get three. Going for third. Throw and it He's standing away. up at third base. Oh, here we are. Third time through the order. And this is Trevor Story unloaded on that baseball. Yeah. Let's see if we can get this guy in. There's one out. Vinny Castillo at the plate. One out and a man on third. And now, Vinny Castillo. To the left okay, side. come on. And that's just foul. Likes that cutter early in the counts. The pitch. That's a double to score the run. That's going to be a 3 1 ball game now. And Castilla is going to easily it's stand up at second base here. Pulls into second. That's an RBI double. Here we go. That's two consecutive extra base hits for these guys. Off the bat, right, Larry Walker coming up again. Way. One man out, one man on second this time. You take your first couple of steps out of the box. You know you've got some real estate to run. That'll be the second out of the inning, but the runner does advance to third base with Todd Helton coming into the box. So next will be the four-hole hitter for the Rockies, Todd Helton. 
a guy who makes an impact not just at the plate but also in the field. No, oh, there it is. Short center. Rocky did that one, but the center fielder is going to chase it down for the third out. But the Rockies do put another run on the board thanks to a double by Vinny Castilla. So it's three to one at Colorado here as we head to the bottom of the fifth. Chad Cool in his fifth inning work here. A lot of sinkers called today. A wind in the pitch. Bounced out to short. Can we make the play? Now the throw Jump the throw, a lot of speed down the base pass. That's a good infield single there. It's a good infield single there. Castillo almost, almost made the play. To get on base. And when he does, that puts him in a position to do some damage, put some pressure on the defense as well. Runner on His first has a lot of speed. There. Not running. Big bat and Cole Calhoun at the plate. Cannot make the mistake here. Left hand hitter waits. And one and two. That's a really good take right there. Slider down and in. Very difficult to get on the same plane and do anything with. All right, fouled off the changeup. The one two. And he grounds one back up the middle. Oh, and they turn two. There's one. Double play. Double what play. a play by Trevor nice Story at second base. What a play there by Trevor Story. Love to see that. Ezekiel Duran. In Two outs Rangers. now here in the end. Grounded out back to the pitcher his first time. In there nice. and it's Way to get it over the plate for strike one. And the righty deals. And a swing and a miss there. Oh, he's got to be pretty proud of this outing so far. Sometimes getting guys a lot of confidence back in that slider. Let's like keep it going. He's attacked hitters. On the Twice now like he's hit back to the pitcher. Ah, the Twice now he's grounded out. Let's go. Through five, end. Colorado has so the lead. Three to the one. Veteran, Garrett Richards. The offense will need to be ready for the New pitcher, stuff. Garrett Richards for through. Texas. And Dante Bichette at the plate. length out of this arm. Coming out of the bullpen, we'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. That's a base hit. And that's a Jam base shot hit. single there. The on the single. Two for three for Bichette today. Pitch was in and off now the plate. So hard to base. do anything with the pitch no in that Arenado location. Arenado at the plate. Somehow he got the barrel to it and hit it well. Pretty amazing. Here's Nolan Arenado. Oh, he rocketed Real that curveball. Center field. That's well struck. He's going to be off the wall. He's got a chance to score Castillo. We're going to send him home. And he is going to score Arenado with an RBI double there. Colorado's up 4-1 to one now here in the top of the sixth inning. CJ Crone now at the plate. Ooh, popped him up with a fastball. Good timing. Just popped that one up on the infield. Simeon makes the play. And there's one away. Well, oh, that's a frustrating into the at bat for the hitter the right there. I mean, that's a black man. Right down they're going to walk him. They're going to intentionally walk Sally Blackman to bring up the catcher, the number nine hit. Let's see if he can make him pay and get a base hit here. Possibly score one run, maybe two. Maybe hit the big play. Let's see what Elias Diaz can do. So in now for Colorado, Elias Diaz. That's a ground ball. That's two. probably going to be two, huh? What a double play, that double play to end it. Over. The intentional walk worked out well for Texas the there. But Colorado does put another one on the board. Now the left fielder, Josh Smith. Chad Cool now. His sixth right inning of work here. No one bears a strike. When a guy's throwing a lot of first pitch strikes as a hitter, you got to be ready to hit. Now, that's not going to help you get deep into his pitch count and into the bullpen, but you got to take what he's offering that day. Now, one strike out already. Let's see if we can get another one. Ground ball Unfortunately, not. But Story makes the play at second base. That's the first out here in the sixth inning. And hand. that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. No Number two. Here's the second base, second base Marcus man. Simeon. Marcus. Yeah, he Change up to start. A little bit of something out. different there to start the bat. Right into the play. It's there we go. Two. This guy's sink has so much drop in it. It's almost like a split finger fastball. Instead of just weak contact and balls on the ground, he gets swings. Swerve gets driven out to center field. Blackman's going to track it down, though. That's going to be two outs here it's in the inning. Out. 
Two outs, base is empty. Now it's the shortstop, Corey Seager. Starting to get that sinker climbing a little bit. Energy is just under half for Cool. This might be his last pitch. inning of work here. Rips one to right. He's got it. All right, we're and through six. The and the Rangers set. We're going to leave Top Cool in there for seven. now. We'll see how Trevor he looks Story coming out in the seven. The Trevor Story to bat the here against Garrett Richards. Cool. That's out to he drives one to center field, but I think that center field is going to be able to cut track that one down. One down. For the first out here in the seventh. Almost a loud start to the inning on Almost. that first pitch, man. He's Almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Let's go, Castillo. In for the Rockies. Another one out to center, center field. field. Look at the center field. didn't have to move. Under it. Brings it in. Two outs now. Two down. Two outs, bases empty. Harry Walker, his Larry fourth at bat here. Digging Larry. in for the Rockies. Walker. First pitch doesn't find the zone. No, one and oh here. Ooh, he chased short. after one. That'll be the third out of the inning. Head to the bottom of the seventh. Colorado still up 4 1 here. And welcome back. Set for the last half of the seventh. And now the switch hitting catcher, Jonah Hines. Oh, we're starting to mix in some other pitches to start at bats here instead of that sinker. That's good to see. Nice pitch there. Change up, maybe a little off the plate. Hine makes contact though. Ooh. Lost the location on that one. Second strike out of the game for Chad Cool. Seventh, seventh inning coming, starting strong. Typically likes to shoot the ball the other way. Now at that time, the little leg Foul ball there. He had some some luck with us here. His first at bat, getting on base and scoring the run for Texas. So. Up the middle. Oh, great grab! What a play by Trevor Story to take away the base hit. Second out here in the seventh. What a play. Trevor Story's had a couple diving stops already today. Old school Trevor Story back here in Colorado. The youngster playing well on defense. Foul ball. All right, one two count here. Let's see what we're going to call. We want another sinker. The one two. Foul okay, ball. he's fouling it off. We're bad on here. Over 70 pitches for Cool here. In Here's the game. a one two. And a, and a strikeout. The, the third the strikeout of the game. The that might be it for Cool. So Todd Helton going to get it in here to start it. Let's go to the bullpen and see what we have. Not a lot of love. Daniel Bard definitely going to be looking at the guy we bring in. We're probably going to get Colome and Gomer warmed up. Let's we'll see what we do here in the eighth. Maybe leave the starter in until he gets in trouble. We'll wait and see what happens. But Todd Helton going to start the eighth inning. And he deals. And first offering is fouled off. Six more outs left for Texas to try to make their comeback. Six more outs for Colorado to try to put more runs on the board. Next one in the dirt. Here we go, Helton. One one count. Now one quickly, miss. quickly back in our favor. Two one. Let's go. And we tried to slap that to the left side. Counts even at two. Two two now. That's a double. Out into left center for Helton a smokes one to left center there. First, for two. That's a double for him to lead off the inning. See if Colorado can keep putting runs on the board. Nice double right there. Loud contact coming off the bat. Didn't get enough. Dante Bichette the having a game so far today. You'll take that swing and that result every time. 
Bichette stands in now, looks at that one inside. Oh, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. Well, we popped out huh? right center field. I don't think that's enough to advance in the third, though. Calhoun makes the grab. And there's nice one throw down. by Calhoun. Keeps us at second base. So one out here in the Nolan eighth, and no one Arenado at the plate. For the one for three. Arenado. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Bullpen action for the Rangers. Couple lefties Matt out there in the bullpen for Texas. To be getting loose. And the 1 0. Turned oh. up and that's foul. Took the, the slider baseline. foul. It's going to hit so the wall and get out of play. Arenado's had a couple long ball balls ball like that the today. Success happens See if he can straighten one out. That right back up the middle approach. Out towards left center. Smith sizes this one up. Again, I don't think that's deep enough to advance that runner. Yeah, there's two down. Not a great throw. But I still don't think we should have forced that. CJ Crone at the plate. Still Todd Helm out there at second base. Two outs now, Nathan. CJ Crone stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Takes an extra step at second base. A base hit may score help. And it's second. Rip to third and what a caught. what a play by the so third baseman. That's why it's called the hot corner, right? Back All right. Here in Denver, Got Red guys warmed up, ready to go. Here's a speed to go. Cool out here to for Paris. his eighth Just inning of work. Cool. Back to work. Back 74 pitches now like in the game for Chad Cool. In between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider. But nice not pitch. Able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Oh, and two now. And that one hit to first. Base All right, unfortunately, that's so the first guy on base. To start the inning. All right, so I think maybe we do go to the bullpen. Well, found himself behind in the count right. Let's go take a look and see what it looks like. Yeah, we go to the bullpen. This one of those so scenes. Lefty, righty, lefty. lefty. I think we do bring Gomez. I think we put Palomay ready and waiting. And Austin Gomez is going to come into the game here. Feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting. Lefty's going to get some action. Here we go. New pitcher in the game for the Rockies, Austin Gomber. And he'll do his best to hang on to this lead. Gomber, not Gomez. Now at the plate as he swings through strike one. Pitch. Again, a lot of speed out there at first base. Gotta watch him maybe take off here. And here comes. That misses the zone. Couldn't get him to chase. Ball in two strikes. High heat coming at you. Got him. Got him. Lefty comes in to face the lefty and gets the punch out. There we go. He's prepared for it, can get to it, but that one just had that little jump at the end, which indicates there's a good spin rate on it, and it didn't decrease in velocity as that hitter's internal clock would expect. First base to runner not going anywhere. Content right now, staying at first base. 0 2 pitch. Got him. Second strike out here for Gomber in the inning. Josh Smith stepping in for the Rangers. Now batting. The left fielder. Slider drops in there for a strike. Looks like it's going to be a wasted opportunity. It's frustrating when you get the leadoff man on, but you can't get him into scoring. Couldn't get the call there with enough of curve. Try to put something up on the board. Trying to go all off speed to this guy so far. And a count one and two. Now is where the catcher wants that fastball. We're going to go up into high and tight here. Two outs. That'll be the third out of the inning. Larry Walker going to put it away. Three more outs. We're heading to the ninth. Three more outs for Texas. Let's see if Colorado can put some more runs on the board. Colome is going to sit down. We're going to get Daniel Bard warmed up and scheduled to come into the game and shut it down and get the save. First, let's see what Charlie Blackman can do here in the top of the ninth inning. LeClerc back to work. And fouled off. That fastball at the bottom of the zone can be very effective. Just got to keep it on the corners. And it's one and one. I thought he was going to call that a strike. I was about to get angry. One one count here. Is they the clerk pitching well coming in here for Texas? That one missing inside. Two and one now. Here you go, Blackman. This is your count, kid. And yeah, the right hander deals. Ooh. Center. Popped it up. Didn't go anywhere with that one. 
Puts it away for the out. All right, we're all right here. Elias Diaz digging in for the Rockies. Slider change up here for the number nine hitter. Now this he is puts a Jolin into right field. Does it get by him? Right field, he tracks it down. But that means the top of the order is going to come up for the fifth time today. Trevor Story gets his fifth at bat in the game. See if he can do something with it here. You see the shift on him to the left, to the left side. First, offering is First pitch fouled slider off. fouled off. Here we go. Right-handed reliever. And he couldn't ball. do anything with that changeup. Quickly 0-2 now. Here's the 0-2. That one There's a shot. Left field. Into the Trevor Story's going to hit a solo home run in the top of the Trevor ninth Story inning to give the Rockies a four-run lead. Trevor Story with a line drive home run here. That brings up Castilla for his fifth at bat today. Trevor Story with a, just a rocket out of the park. That ball left in a hurry. The 0 1 is outside, and it's a long strike. Now, fly ball to right center. That'll be the third out. Okay. So, Daniel Bard's going to come in now in a non save situation. I'm going to bring him in. And we're going to see if he can keep the, the lead and win the game for Colorado. The bats put up five. Cool gave up one run to Texas on a solo shot. So let's see if Daniel Bard can shut the door and send the Rangers home packing today. And the 0-2. Yeah, there's a ball. A lot of junk for Daniel Bard. Two strike change up that just missed. I think it froze it. Swings through that. Sinker makes it the first out of the inning. Sits him down for the first strike out of the game. Oh, you got to be pretty quick with the bat speed these days. So many guys throwing in the upper nine. Seager's getting out there in a hurry, way out in front of that push. Just tough to catch up to. I mean, guys are coming in and they're going max effort. They're not looking to go a long distance. Look, we're two here. As many strikeouts as they possibly can. And a swing and a miss. Second strikeout, a swing and a miss by Seager. Let's go, Daniel Bard coming in, not letting this Ranger team get any hope here in the ninth inning. Strikeouts. See if he can strike out the side. Jonah Heim stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Just one, one, one count away. Try to close it out. Quickly gets so the second strike of the at bat. Let's see if he can close it out here with the side. That's going to be a base Swing hit for Jonah Heim. So the Rangers put one on here. Ninth inning, four run lead for Colorado. Oh, so one more the out needed. After being down in the count, up against it with two strikes right there. That pretty much split I don't the think they're worried about middle, Jonah Heim running here. Let's focus on Indolis at Garcia Heim, and get this last out. With two gone. Next there you go, 0-2 now. For a strike. That's the third. Oh, Renato couldn't hit. make the play. So that's two, that's two men. Throw stops the lead All right, I think second. we go into the two bullpen off. here. And we get Colome warming up as a just in case we need to go to him. Five to one game, two men on, two outs though Better here in the ninth. Lowe. First couldn't get the call there. Right hander kicks deals. And a swing He's back with a sinker for a strike. Able to catch up to that velocity. Ball to strike. To the right That'll be side. it. That'll be the last out. Colorado is going to win this game 5-1 to one and keep the Legends winning streak intact. The Legends still have not lost a game. And the Rockies win even though we don't have any Legend or Hall of Fame pitchers in here. I think the early out there, Nolan Arenado making a great play by not letting that run score in the first inning and throwing the home to get in there uh, on the tag was probably... 
the start of something great because Texas did come up and get a run in the second inning. But you see it here. Trevor Story, Dante Bichette, C.J. Crone getting home runs in today's game. Vinny Castilla getting a couple doubles and some RBIs. What a game. Uh, look at this. Chad Cool goes seven innings of work uh, and gets the win here for the Rockies. The player of the game is going to be Trevor Story. That's it for today's Legends gameplay, guys. I hope you all enjoyed this game with the Colorado Rockies. You'll see them again when we're the Texas Rangers. We'll face the Rockies. The Rangers will be at home this time. So you'll see this team again. So be on the lookout for more Legends gameplay coming at you. Uh, our next game is actually going to be with the Detroit Tigers. So I'm excited to get in uh, to Comerica Park and get some old school Tigers in. Alan Trammell, Al Kaline, uh, Hal Newhauser probably going to be playing here with that, tech, that Tigers lineup. So I'm looking forward to that. Hopefully you are too. As always, guys, I'm AC Kingpin 27 Thank you so much for being here. Hopefully you're enjoying the content. Stay safe out there, and I'll catch you all next time.